Hey guys, it's Adam. I'm excited to do vlog number seven. That is, we're getting up there in numbers. Uh, just to kind of give you an update of where we're at on everything. We had a great event up in Grand Rapids Friday night. It was storming all afternoon. It was supposed to be terrible that night and it ended up being perfect. They moved us all inside, got to interact with some great people, met a lot of people from Grand Rapids, which is a spot I personally don't get to go to a lot. Jake is from Grand Rapids, so he really handles that whole market. So I'm always excited whenever I can go up to the big city um, and see everything going on there. I love that area and it was a really good event. Saturday morning, if you guys were following along, Sarah and I ran in the Kalamazoo County Child Abuse and Neglect Prevention 5K. That was actually emceed by Jake's wife, Erica. For those of you who don't know, Erica works for an organization it's called Kalamazoo County Ready Fours. What Ready Fours does is they prepare all the four-year-olds in the whole county to be able to attend kindergarten. Um, so, she part of that was she got to emcee this event. I actually volunteer with that same organization. I get to read to a preschool every single, um, I get to read to them once a month. Uh, and they provide the books for me. They actually provide them bilingual books because uh, I can speak Spanish. Um, and I really appreciate it when they give me the Spanish ones because kids' books have words that are just so off the wall that I would never uh, know how to pronounce in Spanish or even know like what the word is for it. Um, so that's really cool that she worked for that organization. Uh, and it was important for Sarah and I to support her in that we, Jake couldn't be there because of work, uh, splitting time with Samson's. He had to make up a couple hours in the barbershop on Saturday. Um, but we were really happy to support that. When I came on board, my job was to find social opportunities for Samson. And while we haven't yet announced what our social focus will be as a brand, it's coming because uh, that's such an integral part of Jake's and I's lives. Jake's wife is a social worker. My wife teaches special education. Um, and giving back, taking care of others, investing in the community are really, really, really important to all of us. Um, I ran the Hound before, that was a social enterprise business admission where we took care of kids from inner city Chicago. That's something Jake and I will continue to do. Uh, and we'll use the Hounds to be able to do that, tying it in with Samson's. Um, just to give you guys some more background on who we are as people, Jake and Erica have actually been foster parents since uh, uh, two weeks after they got married, I believe. I think they were on their honeymoon and got the phone call and they became foster parents. Then they may have had like a two month break in between. Uh, and now they've, they're foster parents to three kids, which is, it's mind blowing and amazing. And I'm super proud of them for that. Uh, they're great kids. Erica writes a blog about it. If you guys want to check that out as well. Um, I'll be sure to link it on the Samson's page uh, in case anybody's interested. Um, Sarah and I are not foster parents yet. We're uh, getting licensed, we're going through that process, but we're trying to do something just a little bit different than what they do. Uh, we're gonna be doing refugee or unaccompanied minors, which mean that they're kids who come to the United States um, without an adult and don't have a family in place here to greet them. That is more the role we're gonna do. Because of that, it's not only do we have to go through the state of Michigan, we also have to go through the federal rules for it. Um, and you know, they have a lot more stakeholders at the governmental level. So there's a lot more boxes to check off. Also, if you see my dad today, uh, tell him happy birthday. The chief is 59, um, about almost exactly 30 years older than me. Um, so be sure to tell him hi if you see him. Other than that, our month's almost over. We've got such amazing stuff coming for you guys on in October. So that'll be awesome. Keep your eyes peeled. We'll see you soon, all right? See you later, guys.